Dryden Tactical B. Go on the sticks over there. Just trying to raise two small children is a task daunting in itself, but trying to take them on a fishing trip can feel overwhelming. Other people say it's too much work, that it's just easier to leave them at home, but when I look back on my childhood, nothing seemed to stop my dad from taking me fishing. I might even go so far as to say those young experiences are what brought me to where I am today fishing with my children and documenting it to share with the world just how important these experiences are. Oh, there we go, they both fit. Shallow. Shallow. Oh, you're on. Oh, 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 yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, oh. is he there? He's there. He's there, he's there. Get him, Dred, get him, get him. Yep, he's, he's there. there. Okay, Drayden, reel him in. Reel him in. You gotta get this reel one. Reel him in. You gotta wait for your milk. You gotta catch the fish before you can have your milk. I think he's still on there. Oh, <laughs> mm, so yummy. Huh? Are you done? Yeah. You're done. Oh, 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 he's still there, bud. He's still there. I feel him. I feel him. Do we need the net? <laughs> oh, no, he's not there. <laughs> I just oh, kidding. That's stinky. Oh, no, he is there. Yeah. He is there. What do you got? What is Whoa, he? Oh, that's he's... pretty tiny. He's like, oh. oh, dang it. <laughs> it kind of looked coconut-ish. It kind of looked coconut. You know, maybe it's this year's stockings. Yeah, he's there. Oh, yeah. Come on, come on. Right there, bud. Right there. Reel him in. Reel him in. Reel. Oh, yeah. Look at him. Ooh. Yeah, I feel like if this one's a coconut, then it'll be a keeper. It might be a keeper. Oh, yeah. He's a better fish for sure. All right. Doesn't look like coconut, though. It looks like a uh... rainbow. Ready, bud? Now let's move. Ready? Ooh. Yeah, I've seen the gill plates. Ready? Ah! Oh, Jesus, I almost got him! <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! Good job! Before my children, the water is where I found purpose and meaning in my life. Now, I have the privilege of sharing this experience with the next generation. While my wife thinks I'm a little crazy for my somewhat pie-in-the-sky goals of trading our kids' screen time for stream time, I can't help but feel like our modern habits desensitize us from the beautiful, natural world we live in. You got it. Oh no, that's not the right way. Where'd it go? Oh, it's over here. I got it. Hey! Catch of the day! <laughs> Elizabeth, honey, we don't throw this in the lake. Give me your foot. Give me your foot. <laughs> you can't fish on this. You want to run it? I don't think you've got a fish yet, girlfriend. I think it's time you catch a fish. Hey, hey, look, real fishy. Come on. Come on. Get it in, unhook it, leave it on the bottom of the boat and let her play with it. <laughs> Total meltdown. I know. Oh. Right, do you want to reel it in? Is there or not? It's a little one. You got him hooked in the gill plate, it looks like. Uh, actually, if I were to take a guess, he's either a juvenile rainbow or a juvenile cutthroat. Let's see here. Should we look at him? Look at that little little baby rainbow. Probably probably released as a fingerling this spring. Woohoo! There he goes. That was a nice release. It's like it goes, I gotta calibrate. Happening. Calibrate. Trying to get this osprey, and I got a fish on. <laughs> oh, there he is. You got him? Yeah. Okay. What is he? Uh, looks like a rainbow. Is he? Why 
Boat. That is not a boat. Nope. That is a nice kokanee. Oh, it is a kokanee. Look at that. That's Ooh. the three-year fish we're talking about. Look at that. They did. He caught one. That's an eater right there. Yep. Oh, wow. <laughs> Look at that. There we that's go. A nice one. That's what we're talking about. I don't know if that's my blood or his. <laughs> Whoa, is that a big fish? Yeah. Can you touch it? Don't. <laughs> You're not liking that. Uh. Come on, kiddo. You can't do that, honey. You gotta stay in the boat. Ah, so she's almost got him. <laughs> Woohoo! Good job. All right, here we go. Here we go. That looks kind of like a kokanee to me. Oh. Yeah, that's a kokanee. <laughs> We ended up catching a mixed bag of kokanee, cutthroat, and rainbows. Their size was certainly nothing to brag about, but kids don't care about that. All they care about is the adventures and memories they grow to associate with the outdoors. My son asks to watch Blippi on a daily basis, but when you tell him he gets to go fishing, his eyes light up with the energy of a supernova. So here's my one request for those of you watching. Next time you are planning a fishing trip, take your kid, take your grandkid, take the neighbor's kid from down the street. It might be more difficult, you might land less fish, and you might just leave the legacy of a life-changing outdoor experience in a young person's mind. Been trolling down here the whole time? Maybe, because that's a fish. Oh, no, that's not a fish. That's bottom. Do, do, I guess you're just what I needed. I needed someone to please. Oh. Get it, girl.